Rested upon re-entry to Zimbabwe, he was on his way to his coronation in Bulawayo, scheduled to take place tomorrow. Now, on the line, we are joined by Prince Klabezulu Kumalo, uh, who is from the royal household. Prince Kumalo, thank you very much indeed for joining us. Uh, could you just give us an indication in terms of the circumstances surrounding this arrest? Yes, we just want to correct... Uh we just want to correct the news. Uh, it was he was not arrested, but there was a delay in the arrival of uh, his flight, uh, and people panicked. And then we, you know, there was an issue of whether he has been arrested or not. But uh, we can now firmly confirm that the prince was not arrested. Uh, he is in Bulawayo uh, as we speak. So, uh, in terms of the circumstances surrounding this, just to elaborate more in terms of what happened. His flight, you say, was delayed? Yes, the, the flight uh, was delayed. So, the coronation will go ahead tomorrow as planned, is that correct? We are at the moment disappointed that there was a court ruling uh, uh, today which said that the coronation of our prince is unconstitutional um, and we are absolutely uh, not happy because uh, it's against the will of our people uh, who have been without their king for the last 124 years and we will be uh, fighting it all the way to ensure that our, our king is uh, coronated, but we will respect the judgment and our our lawyers uh, are, are, will be either challenging the issue uh, uh, in court. Uh, Prince Kumala, just remind us how the throne became vacant. The crown became the crown became vacant when our king, Lope Ngula, uh was uh, defeated by the colonizers in 1893. And uh, King Lope Ngula disappeared and the, uh, the colonizers were not able to catch him. And then what happened after was that um, King... King Lopengula's children were then taken from Zimbabwe to uh, Cape Town, sorry, to, to the Cape, uh, in the Eastern Cape, where they have been living up to today. And is the Crown Prince at this moment in high spirits? What's his mood like? We have not been able to speak to him because of a few communication problems with this site, but we are hoping to find out exactly what's happening there. Prince Kumalo, what's the next step? Our next step is that the our next step is that the chiefs are as the people that have been in the forefront together with our people. We are going to find a way of ensuring that the government of Zimbabwe actually accedes to the process of us uh, practicing our culture, because in our culture we have chiefs, and the chiefs are headed by a king. And that is what was destroyed by colonization in our country. And in terms of the constitution, it allows our people to resuscitate their culture, and in our culture there is a king, and that's what we, our people, want as it is. Okay, thank you very much indeed for your time, Prince Slabe Zulu Kumalo, confirming that uh, the Crown Prince was not arrested. So keep it locked on to SABC News for more on that story. Let's move on on the fraud and corruption case.